Tesla CEO Elon Musk a couple of days ago said Tesla can already do without cobalt almost completely. In a reply to a tweet, he said, we use no cobalt at all in most of our cars and tiny amounts in others going to zero soon, whereas phones and laptops primarily use cobalt. In this report, we're going to dig deeper on this report on this, friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel and give us thumbs up for this video if you find it interesting. So the electric Electric car manufacturer Tesla is considered a pioneer when it comes to electric mobility. Even if electric cars are considered an environmentally friendly alternative to conventional combustion engines, there are also materials in the batteries of the vehicles that are definitely considered problematic. Car manufacturers are repeatedly criticized for the use of cobalt in particular. As Tesla boss Elon Musk recently revealed via Twitter, Tesla is almost over with that. Cobalt is an important component of electric car batteries. Precarious mining conditions and child labor in the Republic of Congo call human rights organizations uh, to the scene when it comes to cobalt. And Tesla bus declares that even now, hardly any cobalt is used in Tesla batteries. This is certainly a very good news, friends. I like that very much. So, um, it has become increasingly apparent in recent years that the era of internal combustion engines is slowly coming to an end. More and more traditional automakers are switching to electric vehicles and pioneers such as the United States electric automaker Tesla are experiencing rapid growth. What is often overlooked in the hype surrounding electric vehicles, which are considered an environmentally friendly alternative, is the fact that the batteries of the electric vehicles contain materials that are not only very expensive, but can also be taped under questionable dismantling conditions. The best example of this, of course, is the heavy metal cobalt, which is used in lithium ion batteries. Cobalt is often mined under precarious conditions. The problem with cobalt is that one of the most important mining areas is in the Democratic Republic of Congo. Here, however, the valuable raw material is sometimes extracted under precarious working conditions, which human rights organizations often denounce child labor in the past. For this reason, for example, according to Amnesty International, the civil rights and legal organizations in international rights advocates filed a lawsuit against Tesla, Apple, Dell, and Co uh, Google parent Alphabet and Microsoft in 2019 because the, um, the heavy metal is not only found in batteries for electric cars, but also in laptops and smartphones are installing cobalt in the batteries. As far as the car maker is concerned, some, such as BMW, vow to only obtain cobalt with certified, traceable sources in the future. However, this has not yet changed anything about the illegal mines in Congo. So what are the alternatives? Alternatives are possible. Accordingly, one solution to the cobalt problem is to do without the problematic metal and use other batteries instead. This is uh, actually possible as battery technology has advanced. Battery technology is advancing. Uh, prices are coming down. We see like the, you know, the $100 per kilowatt hour is the parity level between an electric vehicle battery, the cost of electric vehicle and uh, gas cars in terms of when it comes to efficiency and we're seeing the battery technologies are coming down um, in price and once we pass that $100 per kilowatt hour electric vehicles will be less expensive to make and more profitable to market than the gas cars there are now these so-called LFP battery cells for electric cars that use iron phosphate instead of cobalt it was previously known that Tesla already uses the same batteries in the Model 3 uh, made in China China, which are produced in the Gigafactory, like I said, in Shanghai, as well as in the Model Y with standard range. Another advantage of this technology is that it is cheaper and more robust. And we 
Despite initial reports, we're getting lots of good reports from Germany about the uh, Model 3s with uh, LFP batteries. Uh, as you know, that China Gigafactory Shanghai has started shipping them uh, to the European continent from Giga Shanghai and will continue to do so until uh, the Tesla starts working on the Gigafactory Berlin, uh, which looks like is getting approval very soon and the cars will be rolling off the assembly line from Giga Berlin. Now, but then probably Tesla will start building its it's model wise from Giga Berlin from uh, using the 48 uh, 4680 batteries but we don't know uh, if those will be LFP or not I don't know much about the chemical condition of the 4680 batteries if you guys know anything about what types of whether the, those will be 4680 batteries LFP batteries or cobalt or other regular lithium-ion battery technologies let me know in the comment section below please but like I said this 4680 new uh, Tesla batteries they are not about the chemical substance but 4680 refers to the size of the battery cell 46 on uh, 80 uh, millimeters per cell so tesla boss elon musk spoke out recently about this cobalt all the more surprising was the statement by tesla ceo elon musk that almost all tesla models would already do without cobalt he made a tweet about it friend and friends and uh, Here's how it happened. A Twitter user named Sushi Hunter, oh, it's an interesting name, right? Sushi Hunter uh, tweeted on September 25th, a couple of days ago, uh, and asked Tesla does not buy cobalt from sources that use children to mine it. They are also changing their batteries to reduce the amount of cobalt in them. Also, there are good sources of cobalt here in Canada. This user seems to be from Canada because it his uh, user account has the flag of Canada next to it. So to this, interestingly, Tesla CEO Elon Musk responded and said the following. Elon Musk said, we use no cobalt at all in most of our cars and tiny amounts in others, going to zero amounts soon in others, whereas phones and laptops primarily use cobalt. So the tweet came in response to a Twitter, like I said, user who linked the electric car maker to China labor for cobalt in Congo. Now, how is it possible to do without it? How is it possible for Tesla to do without cobalt? Elon Musk's statement now invites speculation as to how exactly the electrical pioneer could have achieved this impressive achievement. According to the relevant industry portal Tesla Mag uh, from Germany, there are two possible explanations for this, friends. One, the one, uh, on, one, uh, on one hand, this could mean that the use of LFP cells in the USA is now making more progress than than previously assumed. The last official stand was that the Model 3 buyers were offered to use the LFP batteries from Tesla produced in China. Um, I think they're made by cattle. According to Tesla Mag, uh, another possible explanation could be that the production capacities in China have now far surpassed those of the Tesla plant in Fremont, which must also mean that almost all Tesla electric vehicles produced in China now have LFP batteries. Whatever the battery status of the various Tesla models, it is no secret that Elon Musk would like to use more LFP than cobalt containing batteries in the long term. The question is how long it will be before then. So guys, let me know your thoughts on this place. If your Tesla is running on uh, LFP battery, let me know in the comment section and let our team, our uh, community know in the comment section what has been your experience. It will be interesting to know. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla news ring the bell so you don't miss my next tesla coverage which i which i do several a day and also give us thumbs up if you found this report helpful i would greatly appreciate you sharing this in social media have a great day god bless everyone peace be with all of you and your families love all of you and see you soon in our next report